Hey guys, so today I'm going to tell you how I do um, my milk made braids. They're not mine, but you know, they're called milk made braids. Um, a lot of women have been staring at me in the metro when I do this. And a lot of people have asked me, like genuinely came up to me and asked me how I do this. So I assume since they look so good, you can do it. It's very easy. It takes you like three minutes tops if you get used to it. If you have like really light hair like me, it takes like five minutes or so. If you want to have like clean um, no paint braids, then go ahead and comb your hair. Or if you want like a little messy beachy milk paint braids, then you can obviously you know leave it like this. My hair is just like this in general all the time, so I'm not even gonna think about combing it. Okay, um, I'm just gonna go and kind of go like this and then just going to buff it a little bit just a little huh? not too much because then it'll start to you can take any size these um i don't know what these are called bob pins or whatever i'm gonna use a bigger one because this lot of the hair is kind of like difficult to adjust just put it like that I don't need to because my hair is going to be crazy anyways. Yay! So now what you need to do is turn around like this and you can um, part your hair with your own fingers or you can you know use a comb. I'm just going to use my fingers because I have a degree in parting hair. Yeah. And then you can secure this side of your hair or you can just leave it like this and then take this part of the hair in the back and basically we are going to take all of that and braid it it's not that difficult so you're just going to braid it like this keep on braiding if you feel like your hands are getting tired because believe me they will feel tired braid on the other side. So braid it like this if you feel the need to because if you braid it on this side it's just going to make your braid really loose. Just braid it like this and it's getting very monotonous. So you go braid it like that. And the thing with this is, um, look how light my hair is, you can see it's like, okay, braiding it, <clears throat> okay, so I'm going to leave it like this because my hair is so light, this won't open, you can either put a scrunchie here or a little bit of um, elastic band and secure it, but I'm just going to leave it like that, and I'm going to do the braiding, the same thing on this side, do I look stupid? I'm sorry. I try to look pretty. It doesn't always look. So doing the same thing here. Hide. So once when we are done with the two braids, I look like a little school girl. Whee! Okay, so once when you're done with the two braids, you're gonna need these really, really tiny uh, clips. What you need to do is just basically place your hand here at the end of the braid. Just take the braid and pull it up like a headband. Let me just situate that like so. Make sure that you pull it like in the front a little bit. And then just take these tiny pins. Also use those clippy clips. I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> okay. And then the same thing. I'm kidding. Down here. Actually, this one's gonna be wobbly. But it's okay. Place your hand here. Braid like that. Make sure you cover this portion. Place this one alignment with that one like this yeah and then you can just clip it also <sighs> done 
that's it. That's all you have to do. And it looks so pretty. That's it. That's all you have to do. It's like this. It looks really cute. I do this every single day in the morning. It's really nice if you are growing out your hair. So you can just oil your hair like the ends and then you can just play it. Put it up like this. It looks nice and neat and presentable and kind of looks cute too. So I hope you like this video and if you didn't subscribe to the subscription button at the bottom of this video. Um, if you like this video do give it a thumbs up and if you like this video a little bit too much you can also share it with your friends. Bye!